There's a salmon recipe at Pacifica Restaurant in Del Mar that has become the stuff of a legend. It's been a fan favorite for more than 20 years, and now Amber is about to reveal the secret recipe. So when it comes to Del Mar, there are a ton of places to choose from when it comes to eating fresh seafood. But what if I told you on top of a gorgeous view of the ocean, they also have a signature dish that's been on there for over 25 years. That means something. Guys, welcome to Pacifica Del Mar. Hi, Chef Chris. Hello. Hi, thank you for joining me. I know you are a very busy man. So I appreciate that you took a break with me. However, not a bad break. We've got the ocean all, behind no. us. We are in the village in Del Mar. Um, I want to get straight to it because I think this is so cool. You have been open for, is it 32 years? 32 years, yep. That's incredible, especially you've seen a lot. You've seen pandemics, you've seen wildfires, you've yes. seen a lot. Yep. And then you've been up north, but something brought you to San Diego and you've stayed here ever since. Yeah, well I work for a lot of great chefs up in, up north and uh, and I wanted to bring it down to San Diego. I like the weather down, down here a little bit better. Yeah. And uh, you know, it was kind of a budding scene uh, in the early 2000s, so um, I wanted to come down and put my mark on it. Nice, well you definitely put your mark on it because believe it or not, you have a signature dish that's been on the menu for 25 years. And yes. I just, I'm blown away by that because I feel like menus constantly change. Yeah, it's a dish that, yeah, it's been on uh, over 20 years. Um, and it's just, I think the key is the spice blend I have on there and the combination of flavors. Through the years I've sourced different salmons, but I'm using a great uh, harmonious raised Verlasso salmon right now that's just incredible you know it's a dish I listen to my guests so I've tried to take it off the menu before and they're and like bring it, it back. back so <laughs> that's what's helped keep it uh, as a signature dish for us absolutely well listen uh, to the people because they're obviously right yes. and it's also beautiful yeah thank now, you. some people don't know they are open for breakfast lunch and dinner this isn't just a beautiful spot to have dinner it's a great view yep um, but you can come from breakfast and I'm assuming is this kind of a yeah a that's breakfast? one of our brunch items um, it's a I use a, a locally sourced um, bread and sea whole grain toast uh, with avocado, I do some slow roast tomatoes, goat cheese, a little wild arugula, a little sherry gastric, and olive oil. Very so, nice, very delicious. healthy. This is also yep. looks like a very fresh, healthy dish. Yeah, that was a dish that was inspired from a little Hawaii trip I took with uh, okay. to ahi poke. Yeah. My version's over a little sushi rice, uh, poke sauce I make, um, macadamia nuts, mango, a little watermelon radish. It's simple, delicious, but fresh. simple and delicious. Yep. And I'm looking over at that. That looks like something I don't even want to dig into because <laughs> it's so beautiful. Is that an yeah. avocado? It's a fun dish. We just I just put on the menu. It's a it's a charred avocado, and I do an octopus salad okay. uh, inside of it. It's kind of a Mediterranean inspiration. Um, it's something I uh, put on the menu, and I get a lot of people that don't even know that wouldn't like octopus. I get them to right. eat it, and they love it. So oh, look at you, yeah. tricking people left That's and right. right. <laughs> I like it. And then of course we have to go to the drinks because you guys are known for you yes. know having a drink and getting in the view here. So which one is your favorite? My favorite is uh, Smokey the Pear. Okay. Uh, we do uh, it's a mezcal mixed with a pear liqueur and a tahini rim. It's delicious. Very I nice. love the smoky flavor of it. But I also do a barrel aged Negroni, and then I have a. Uh, Margarita that's uh, made with Avion and finished off with 100-year Grand Marier. I call it just cuz. <laughs> well, I'm going to drink all of these all just cuz. Right. <laughs> you know, because it's the middle of the Let week and we have to. And I'm also going to take a bite. Uh, guys, come down to Pacifica. Oh, good stuff. All right. All right. Thank you. Very good stuff. Come down here to Pacifica Del Mar. You will not be sorry for the view, for the food, and of course the fact that they've been open for 32 years. That says something right there. Chris, thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.